today. This is Alistair Christie from LearnDelphi.tv and this video is sponsored by me. If you check out premium videos on my website and go and buy a copy of the uh, Mega Pack, that'll help me out greatly. But anyway, what I wanted to talk about today is regular expressions and what I want to be able to do is take this web page and download all the photos associated with it. So um, this, this uh, property is associated with that reference. So as we can see down here, there's a reference somewhere. There we go. Um, so that those match. And if we view the source code uh, for this and scroll through, these are the photos I want to find. Now that is actually quite easy to do using regular expressions. So if I copied that and go to our regex101.com and paste the uh, the web page text into here. I've come up with this regular expression uh, to find all the photos, and we can see that it finds 22 matches, and that is in fact the sort of URL I want to uh, capture. So forward slashes are, have special meaning in regular expressions, so we need to escape them with a backslash, and likewise with dots. And so this is, you know, image server dot property suite dot code dot nz slash professionals slash listing main blah. Now, uh, this dot star uh, says match any characters uh, except a new line, uh, and it will stop when we reach uh, dot jpg, and that, of course, slash escapes that dot. Now, if I remove that, uh, it actually matches everything uh, in that in that block. Um, possibly right down to the very end of the file? No. Uh, to... No, we get one, one match, and it's really long. So uh, this question mark says, don't be greedy. And we'll match, uh, find the first match. So uh, the first match that, that ends in .jpg rather than the, the last one. So that gives us uh, a whole bunch of matches and for some reason um, the, the last image is also the first image. Um, it might, might be some of the, something to do with the, um, the prop, uh, photo cycling thing that it does, but uh, I don't know. So let's look at the, um, the Delphi code for this. So I have a little uh, class that uh, downloads photos and we go and uh, look up that URL and grab um, the listing corresponding to that reference, and we want to return the list of URLs. So if we find that web page, uh, we'll get a, forget a 404, we'll get an exception or something like that, or our page is moved or something. Um, but if we, we do find it, we then want to run our regular expression match that we worked out, or that I worked out, and then for every match, I'm just adding that that match into my list of URLs, but adding HTTPS at the beginning of it. And the uh, first one is also the last one, um, repeated. So I delete the first one. So that's all very simple. Um, and I'm using ND for the, uh, if we look at the base class, we see we have a creating an ID HTTP with SSL support, uh, making sure I support the relevant SSL versions. And it, this implements an interface of iPhoto Getter, which just has this one, one method on it. And so to see that working, I can run the application. And I'll need a copy of that. Reference. Uh, running, OK. That's working really hard. Must, must be uh, having Camtasia running as well uh, being quite painful. There we go. So I just need to create a listing with that reference to be able to download the photos. And we're only going to download the photos for that one listing. So I'll select that and you can see I've already been uh, doing a bit of testing. Professionals. Okay. And it goes in uh, looks up that web page and works out all the photos that it needs to download. And that's them. So that's that's fairly, fairly straightforward. And I just 
begin download and it will download those um, for that listing. Don't just do that. There we go and we see we've got uh, lots of photos. So um, that is pretty much all I wanted to show you. The actual application is not really relevant to you, but the fact that it finds those URLs. Now, if you wrote um, some string matching routines yourself using pos and and uh, delete and copy and all that kind of kind of thing, um, you'd probably have to write quite a bit of code uh, to do this. But effectively, I'm d finding all of those URLs with a single line of code, which is quite powerful. Regular expressions are definitely something worth learning if you're not familiar with them. And this on online regular expression uh, tester is a, um, a good place to start. De Delphi implements the, the PCRE um, regular expressions that has a, uh, a DLL that gets linked or some, some libraries that get linked to the application. So I think that's probably all I need to cover. Um, you need to use the um, system.regular expressions unit to access it. Uh, and T-Regets has um, lots of other methods on it as well. Uh, I wanted to find all the matches, but you could just find one, you know, find the first one, or um, uh, you also, because the regular expression is compiled, you can use the constructor uh, if you're using the same regular expression over and over, which, which technically I could be, but I think the uh, it's compared to downloading web page, this this line of code is uh, really quite quick in comparison. So um, that's all I am covering in this video. Again, go check out the Mega Pack uh, or some of my other videos. Um, I have quite a few, but the Mega Pack is the, the com complete set. Um, I'm Alistair Christie. Thanks for watching.